If your Samsung phone can't install apps due to parse errors, then this video is going to show you how to fix it. Sometimes you might get an error message that says there was a problem parsing the package or something similar. The issue could be software related or issues with a backdated One UI version. So you can try out these solutions to fix the problem. But the first thing we can try is to go to our settings application and scroll down and find the security option. It should be called security and privacy for some versions, but if you find security, you can just go over there and open this up. Now scroll down once again and find more security settings and tap on it. After that, scroll down once again and find the install application or install unknown apps option. Tap on this. Never mind, let's tap on this. Anyway, from here, you need to make sure to enable the Google Chrome or the Samsung Internet Browser. Basically, you need to enable the browser that you're installing the application from. For example, if you install the application from Google Chrome and it's set to del uh, like denied over here, then the Google Chrome application will not be able to install the unknown application. So make sure to toggle on the Google Chrome from here. And if you're using Samsung Browser to install the application, make sure to enable Samsung Browser from here or any other browser that is available. After enabling the feature, see if that fixes the problem or not. If the issue is persisting, we can check for software version. So for this, we can go to our settings application, scroll down and go to about phone and then go down again and go to software information. From here, you will see your one UI version. It said 7.0 for me. But if you have an one UI version 6.0 or 5.0, then that is a backdated software version. And that could be the cause behind your problem. So you can just manually select the one UI version and search for it. For example, you want to install a backdated YouTube version, the YouTube application. So what you can do is open up your Chrome browser or any other browser and search for something like this. YouTube APK for Android 14. So search for this over here and if you're using the Android 14 version of your Samsung One UI which is basically the One UI 5 or 6 so you can just select that and go to the website that you want to download the application and download the version of that like you can download the Android 14 version which will be basically your One UI 6 and if you have the One UI 5 then you have to install the Android 13 version so, and basically go beyond something like that. Anyway, install the older version of that application from your designated browser and that should fix the problem. And usually that is the issue and even if you that... Sorry, I'm worried. Usually that fixes the issue, but sometimes even after doing that, the problem might persist. So what you can do is you can go to your settings application again, scroll down to software update and go there and go to download and install if your phone has any software updates available then make sure to install the updates and try the process once again after updating usually the problem gets fixed so that will basically help you with your problem so guys that's how you fix the parsing errors on your samsung galaxy phone if you found this tutorial helpful then be sure to give it a like and subscribe to this channel for more useful tips thanks a lot for watching